<laughs> Yo. Listen. Listen. I told y'all, man. I told y'all. Welcome back to another episode of the It's Just Different Podcast, man. And look, I told y'all before the season started, I told y'all, be careful what you ask for when it comes to this man, LeBron Goat James. Listen, year 17, age 35. Come on, man. The Lakers just advanced to the conference finals. Gentlemen's sweep of the Houston Rockets. Five games. Look, man. Listen. Listen. I'm not even looking at this thing I have on my computer now of the stat sheet and all of that. I don't even got to look at it. But listen, man. LeBron James. He had a one-year absence from the conference finals, and that was last year. When he got hurt with that groin injury, Christmas Day. And when he got hurt, here's what people don't, people cheat seem to gloss over. When he left, when he got hurt, they were in the fourth spot that day. And yes, he returned back, but he returned back early, still injured, and decided to see if he can give a, a go, a playoff push with the team. And... He just wasn't good enough. The team wasn't good enough. Um, he was still hurt. Other guys got injured during that that span. It, it was just not. It was just a bad end of that season after he tried to come back. But you know, you got people who who sit there and they go, "Well, he played last season. He didn't make the playoffs," and that's just an ignorant statement. But if that's what you choose to believe, then that's fine. But all I got to say is this. I am a Kawhi Leonard fan as well. For other, you know, for those who think he's the best player in the world, I'm a, I'm a fan of Kawhi. I went for the Raptors in the finals last year. But even I would tell you I only rooted for the Raptors because I didn't like Golden State, number one. And two, Kevin Durant was, was hurt. Like, come on, man. Do anybody truly believe that? The Raptors would have won that series, had Kevin Durant. Listen, if Kevin Durant had played, that would have been a 4-0 embarrassing sweep. Kawhi can't do what LeBron James did, go out there and 51-8-8 with nobody on the court. But the janitor and some maintenance men, he can't, he can't do that. So that would have been, that would have been an embarrassing sweep. 4-0 sweep in that finals had Kevin Durant had had he played. But we all know what ended up happening and all of a sudden people think that Kawhi Leonard is the best player in the world. But listen, I said it before the season started and I'll say it again. Be careful what you ask for because now that man from Akron is in the conference finals with that Lakers team and they, when I tell you they've turned it on the last two games turned it on, turned it on. Now they're waiting for those vaunted Clippers who couldn't close out the Nuggets the other night. Now you got LeBron James, Anthony Davis, playoff Rondo. <laughs> and they are sitting there waiting on the Clippers. Because guess what, Kawhi? It don't go through you. To get to the finals, it doesn't go through you. It goes through that man, LeBron Goat James. And all of your protectors and defenders, y'all all get what y'all wanted. LeBron James for a chance to go to the NBA Finals. And I am telling you, I don't know why people do it to themselves, but everybody's going to bet against LeBron James, and he's going to put on another historical playoff series and after that, people are going to go, well, he's still not better than Jordan. Look, I'm not having that debate today. We can do that for another day. But all I want to tell y'all, man, is LeBron James is here. He's batting where he belongs in the conference finals. 
and Kawhi Leonard. We'll see you soon. Peace.